تم بدء التسجيل السلام عليكم كان هنا كان هنا من يوم اوكي right it's only 19 of you well i mean unless those who did not attend have other <coughs> classes or so uh, would have been fine otherwise they'll, they'll miss a lot <coughs> excuse me i just have the uh, that voice as, as, as usual. Anyway, right, so um, today I'll be, I'll be uh, giving you um, a revision, well, a detailed revision for the exam. So this is quite important, and I'm recording this, sec this section as well, so um, whoever did not make it, they can uh, refer to it later, even for you if you want to, if you want to uh, refer to it um, later. Right, so um, First of all, I just you know I'm sure you know when when your exam your, your exam is your exam is on the 17th, which is next Sunday, uh, starting from uh, five o'clock, finishes at six, so it's, it's an hour it's an hour paper. Now uh, the exam will will include uh, or might include actually uh, multiple choice questions. It will also have. Um, uh, it definitely is going to have uh, like uh, a binary arithmetic. Uh, operations, meaning that uh, you have to uh, um, uh, um, do multiplication, addition, subtraction, and so forth. Uh, also, it will it will have conversion, binary conversion or numbering system conversion between system and system. It will also uh, uh, definitely it will have um, things uh, regarding the um, uh, instruction cycles. So. I might I'll give you equations or or, um, or codes and ask you to tell me how this uh, is uh, done um, uh, in the instruction cycle. Um, now, just some tips for you for the exam. Uh, you'll get your exam paper. It's quite, it's quite not necessarily short. It will, it will require you um, uh, thinking. It will, um, you need, you know, this is the important part, you need to read each question very carefully. As I said, my instructions are always precise. I did not accept any student do what they like to do. So uh, when I give you, when I ask a question, you have, to, you have to do it precisely as I ask you to do it. Okay, always know something about me. When I give a question, I am very direct. And I want a very direct answer regarding uh, and um, uh, um, basically regarding the question itself. I mean, like you have to read it very well and um, uh, uh, do not miss anything. Any point I ask you to do and, and you miss it, you'll you'll get a mark uh, uh, deducted from your uh, from, from your paper. Right. Uh, also, you know the exam um, um, coverage. It'll uh, the exam will uh, will be. Um, from lecture one to lecture seven, okay. So I have uh, seven lectures uh, of the exam. All the slides are available for you. All the recordings are available. Um, now I was told some people uh, cannot access the recordings. Is this so? Do you have a problems with the recordings? Do you have problems? If you do, put check. If you do not, uh, put across. You have a problem with the recording. Now, can you tell me what the problem is? Raise your hand. Tell me what the problem is. OK, raise your hand and tell me what the problem is. This is important. It has to be sorted because uh, the exam is only a week away. So basically, like 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 now, you have, you have the, you've already finished the exam. Uh, right. Yeah, can you please tell me what the problem is? Okay, you um, you've gone somehow. Okay, anyway, well, <coughs> if you do have problem, you need to sort it out as soon as possible. Only one one week left for the for the exam. Right. Uh, well, let's get started on the uh, some material. So what I'll do today, uh, I'll I'll divide um, uh, I'll divide today's session um, into two. I think I said the three. I can't remember now. Anyway, uh, I'm going to divide today's session into into two sections. Uh, really, I'm going to I'm going to give you some uh, questions uh, for you to practice, and I'll give you the answers as well. Uh, I'll show you the answers, and also uh, at the end of the session, I will uh, leave um, I will uh, I'll leave you to ask to ask questions uh, as well if you have questions. Now I'm going to ask, 
have you revised for this subject? Very important question. And answer me honestly. Have you revised? If you have revised, put, put a green um, check. Have you revised? Now, one, su one student uh, has has not. Have you revised? Have you done? Any, have you done any revision? Have you opened? Have you opened any of the slides? Have you opened any of the virtual uh, recording? Have you done any revision? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Most of most of you have. Okay, most of you have. It is very important. Try honestly. If you if you think you're gonna leave it to the last weekend, you, you will fail. And I'm telling you this. This is my experience. If you leave your revision two days, three days before your exam, you will fail my exam, no doubt. My exams require a, a, a lot of. Um, uh, you need you need to you need to work. You need to work. It, it requires a lot of thinking and a lot of understanding. Anyway, let's get a crack on. Right. So uh, let me start with the first problem. Now, um, this question, um, I'm not sure I haven't missed anything. OK. First of all, before I start on this, right, let's, uh, let's review the, uh, I'll, I'll review each chapter and I'll tell you what, uh, what it's about. Now, chapter one is a theory, chapter, theoretical chapter. Uh, you need to start study the theory. You might get asked a few questions, uh, theory questions. Okay, so it's all like a general understanding of the computer. So you need to you need to memorize it basically and understand the concept. So you might get asked a couple of questions uh, regarding this chapter, a theoretical question which you have to answer. Right, or you might you might get them in a form of a, a multiple choice. Now, a question, uh, a chapter, uh, uh, sorry, lecture two and lecture three. Uh, to do with binary, which I will go through now. So um, uh, very important to lectures. Very important. You're definitely going to get asked uh, questions regarding this. Right um, now, let us do some conversion. Now, if I if I give you this problem, uh, if I oops, excuse me, let me get my pen. As you do, I always forget it. Now, if I uh, if I give you this problem, I say, okay, then you have a b c dot D E it is in hexadecimal of course because uh, as you can see we have letters and I ask you to convert it to binary convert it to binary now uh, I'll give you two minutes to uh, to think about it or to try it I'm sure you, do you have all pen and papers you should have uh, pen and papers in front of you now because I will, uh, I will ask you two questions. So try this question for me. I'll give you two minutes. I'll leave the, I'll leave the chat on as well uh, if you want to discuss the problem or uh, you know. Okay. Uh, yeah, I have a question. Uh, yeah, Munir, go on. Hi, Victor. Uh, Hi. Not a question. I solve it. So we don't have to. Is our hand if we solve? Do you know speak of? I can't hear you very well. Munira? I couldn't hear you very well, Munira. I'm, so, I'm sorry. Okay. Right. Um, you solve the question only. I I don't have a question. Okay, okay. Solve the question. You've done it. Okay, that's that's good. That's good. If you have done it. Okay, that's good. Okay, so I'm getting good the responses there. You, you've solved it. So, uh, right. Uh, who can volunteer to to solve this question? Who can volunteer to solve this question? Who wants to volunteer? Okay, you want to volunteer, right? Let me give you the permission. Uh, in fact, yeah, there we go. Now you can you can actually write on this whiteboard. Uh, can you solve it for us? And I'll, I'll I'll open the mic for you as well. You can speak as you um, as you solve it. Okay, uh, we will solve it. Uh, a, it's uh, equal to uh, ten, which is yeah. Which is uh, one one? Yep. Uh, no, yes, one hang zero. Hang Sorry, I don't know. I don't. Know, I don't know how to write with this. Okay. Can use, I, use the, um, okay. Use use the use the mouse. Uh, right. Um, use the mouse to to write. Okay. Use the mouse to. 
Um, do you have a mouse or, or a laptop? No, I'm laptop. I don't have a mouse. Oh, I see. I see. Yeah, it could be. It could be difficult. Actually, okay, yeah. Can you type like, in, in chat? Okay. Actually, you're on the right track. So uh, basically, if we have the. Uh, as I said to you, uh, all of the hexadecimal we go from zero to fifteen. Okay, remember this. So uh, obviously we can only go from zero to nine. After nine, it's ten. So we cannot use ten because it has two digits. It has the zero and it has the one. Um, so uh, we use uh, alphabet instead. We, use, we go from A to F. So always, um, always A is equivalent to, as Munira said, to ten. Okay, and then we have B equivalent to eleven. C equivalent to twelve. Uh, we have D equivalent to 13, and we have E equivalent oops, to 14, and we have F equivalent to 15. So we have from we have uh, from 0 to uh, 15. Now, uh, now remember now. Uh, well, you can write it in the chat now. Tell me um, in decimal how many binary do we use for each character in the hexadecimal? Four. Yes, thank you. Right, it's four. So let's start from, from the E. Let's go from the E. Right, E, as we said, is 14. Now, what is 14? What is 14 in case uh, Mahi il binary? Okay, what is 14? I'll, I'll send you now. What is 14 in, uh, in, um, in binary? Yeah, it is uh, exactly. It is 0, 1, 1, 1. Now, how do, how do we know this is 14? Now, let me open a new page for those who might have a problem. Right. So, how, how do I know that 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, okay, so, sorry, ignore this. How do I know it's 1, 1, 1, 0 is a, uh, is a uh, 14? Uh, right, it's easy. What you could do, um, always, because you're converting now from binary to decimal, we have two times multiply by two. So we go two, but it's to the power of zero, because as I said, we start from zero and we go upward. Times what? Times this zero. Okay? Plus, now we can work this out, it's two to the power of 1, okay, because this is the next number, times by 1, which is this number here, okay, uh, plus 2 to the power of 2, also times 1, plus 2 to the power of 3, also times 1, okay, anything, anything to the power of 0 is 1, but however, 1 times 0 is 0, so we don't care about it. Plus, 2 to the power of, of 1 is 2, times 1 is 2, plus 2 to the power of 2 is 4, times 1 is 4, plus 2 to the power of 3 is 8, times 1 is 8, so 8 plus 4 plus 2 equals 2, 12. Uh, 14, sorry, equals to 14, okay, equals to 14. So if we go back, okay, this is how we solve the, four, the, the 14. Okay, so 0, 1, 1, 1, so that's correct. Now the D in the same manner, but the D, D is 13, so what is D? What is D? Huh? It's exactly correct, yep, 13. 13 is 1. 0, 1, 1, because this will be 12, 8, and 4. 12 and 1 is 13. Now, what do we do next? What do we do next? We put the dots, okay? The question is how to memorize each number. I gave you a table at the beginning of the semester to memorize, but however, don't try to memorize it. To memorize it, to try to understand it. Okay, uh, if you want to memorize this number, I think I gave you a table uh, at the beginning of the semester. But again, try to uh, 
uh, try to understand how we work. Right, C is a 12, easy. So obviously we have, we're going to have to put our dot, okay, because we're working in, in you know, like this is just like saying, just like saying 3.4, okay, so this is, uh, this is valid, the point, okay. So, uh, right, okay, uh, now you know what I have the C. The C is a 12, simply, it's 0, 0, 1, 1, because this is 8 and this is 4, we get a 12. Now the B is 11, so you're going to have 1, 1, 0, 1, Oops, I don't know if places, um, yeah, 1, 1, 0, 1, so we have 8, 10, 11. Now, uh, just forgive me, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to write the, the A uh, here, because I, I don't have to uh, uh, place. Uh, A says uh, 10, um, right? So the 10 is 1, 0, 1, 0. Okay, so this is 8 and this is 2. They will make up 10. By the way, I will show you, I will show you a trick on how to get this uh, easy. I'll show you a trick in a minute. Okay, so this is the answer to this, right? Sorry for the mess, but this goes first and, you know, in, in, this, in this order. And remember, every 4 bits in binary represent one hexa. Okay, so every four bits in, bi in binary represent one hexa. Right, so let's um, give you another question. Right, uh, what if I say to you, convert 500 uh, you have. You also have to use these uh, in the exam. So you put the bracket and you put a annotation on which number system is this. So when I put 500 and then between the bracket 10, I mean uh, it's in decimal. So 500 in decimal converted to uh, hexa. Now convert to hexa. Now before you convert it to hexa, can anyone tell me how would we do this before before you solve this? Tell me how how can we actually work this out? Can you tell me? Okay, again, Munira, right. Can you tell me how we, how we, how could we actually think about this? Okay, we, first of all, we have to convert it uh, decimal to binary, then from binary yeah, to hexa exactly. by, yeah. Uh, yeah. okay. Yeah, that's, that, that's fine, yeah, yeah, that's correct. Uh, the easiest way to do this is to have an intermediate uh, level between the two have an intermediate level. The intermediate level will be changing the decimal to binary because it's easy. And then again, the other step is also easy. You just have to divide the binary into four bits groups, and then you have your hexa. So it's fairly easy. So now, um, now the question is, how do we convert decimal to binary? How do we convert decimal to binary? Divide by two. Yeah, thank you. That's right. Divide by two. So let's start the division. Okay. So we need to. Um, uh, right. Okay. Let's just start the division. So we go by. We go 500 divided by two. Okay. What's uh, what's 500 divided by two? It's 250. Right. It's 250 uh, times two is 500. The remainder, the baqi, zero. Okay, that's the first one. Now, okay, by the way, the page is not going to be enough, but I'll, uh, I'll see. Now, now, now we're going to to bring, we're gonna have to bring this result, we're going to have to bring it here. Okay, so we, we, we say 250, again, divided by 2, it's 125, 125 times 2, it's 200. And 50, also the remainder is 0, okay, now we're going to have 125 divided by 2, it's uh, 62, 62 times 2 is 124, now the remainder is 1, we continue, okay, we have the 62, so 62, Divided by 2, you get 31. 31 divided by, uh, 31 times 2 is 62. The remainder is 
zero. And then I have to continue uh, down here. Sorry, excuse me. All right, so uh, we have the 31 now. 31 divided by 2 is 15. 15 times 2 is 30. And the remainder is 1. Okay, now we have the 15. The 15 divided by 2. We have 7. 7 times 2 is 14. And the remainder is 1. Now we have the 7. Se uh, yeah, we have the 7. 7 divided by 2 is a 3. 3 times 2 is 6. And we have a remainder is 1. Now we have the 3. 3 divided by 2 is 1. 1 times 2 is 2. And the remainder is 1. Okay? Now, now we have uh, we have a one here. One divided by two is zero, because we obviously we don't have ones and twos. So uh, one divided by two is zero. Uh, zero times two is is uh, zero, and the remainder is one. Now, when you have when do, when do you stop this operation? You stop when you have the result here zero. When the result uh, of the division is zero, then you stop. Now. Now, now, what do we do next? Can you tell me what do we do next? Yes, thank you. Some of you already saw, saw this. Very, very, very good. Very good. Right. So uh, now we have the binary. But remember, the binary will not go like this. It's rather going to go like this, meaning the last remainder you 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 found out you need to bring it first on the left. So you're going to have one. One, how many one? One, two, three, four, five. You're going to have five ones. Four, five. You're going to have five ones, and then you're going to have zero, one, zero, zero. Okay? So you're going to have one, two, three, four, five ones, uh, uh, zero, one, zero, zero, and then you put the two out here to indicate that this is the binary. Okay? By the way, if you have a question, at any point, raise your hand. This is not like the lecture. This is a revision. So any question, anything I say, anything I do, you do not understand, ask me a question straight away. Right, OK. We haven't finished. We, now, if you, if you finish until, until this point in the exam, you get half the mark, because we haven't quite finished. So excuse me, I'm going to use another page, because obviously the, the, the question was to convert the, fi the 500 hexa, we wanted to uh, sorry the 500 decimal. We wanted to convert to hexa, so we converted to binary. Now we need to um, uh, continue with the hexa. So just uh, I don't forget, we've got five ones, zero and hundred. Okay, so we had five ones, one, two, three, four, five, zero, one, zero, zero. If I remember correctly. What happened there? Zero, zero, one, zero, and uh, okay, that's fine. Right, okay. Um, now, obviously, it's easy. We're going to have to uh, count for a bit. So, one, two, three, four. Okay, we put our, our line, and then one, two, three, four. We also put our line. And here, you, you can add zeros, but uh, think about it. Zeros will not be uh, significant here. You can add them or not. Well, you know, add them. It's good to, to work always, where your work is consistent, but it will not, it will not make a difference. Now, um, uh, what, this, what is this number? This number is 4. What is this number? The middle one is F, because it's 15. Okay, but we do not have 15 in hexa, we have F. Uh, and what, what is this, uh, the last number? is 1. So the answer simply will be 1 F 4. And that is in hexadecimal. Is this understood? Easy enough? Easy enough? OK, good, good. It's, uh, it's fairly easy. Right. Um, let me give you another question. Uh -huh. You work this out. Can you work this out?
Okay, think about it. We have octal to binary. Fifty-two. Mm, I think you. Yeah, I know what uh, your mistake. It's not fifty-two. Think about it. Why do you put fifty-two and twenty-five? It's, it's, it's a binary. Convert to binary. I know I tricked you a little bit. I know, I know where you're coming from. Think about it again. I asked you to convert to binary. Do we have numbers? Do we have do we have like this in binary? Do we have numbers in binary? Okay, don't jump into conclusion. Think about it. Think. Why, Muna? Why why twenty five convert to binary? Okay, I think you are suffering from this. Now, um, tell me, um, we said in the hexadecimal, uh, four bits represent one hexa. What about the octal? How many bits represent one octal? Three. You answered me. That's it. So why all the mess up? Right. Remember something. By the way, I deliberately put this. Is uh, one zero one dot zero one. Uh, in the in the previous uh, years, uh, I used to teach uh, logic, and I brought it to my students uh, in the exam, I think, and they all thought it was binary. No, it's not binary. Basically, I'm not saying one zero one point zero one. All I'm saying is hundred and one point one hundred. It's octal. I'm, I'm not talking binary. Look, right. You have to always uh, keep in mind this here. So it's octal. So you, you don't go 101.01 بكل بساطة 101.1 فاصلة واحد بالمئة. انتهى الموضوع. Right. Now you you started you started uh, thinking about it now. Right. So each each digit in the octal it's a three in the binary. Right. So one. What is one in binary? In, uh, as, as a three digit representation, as a three digit representation, yes, thank you. It's one zero zero. Okay, now what is zero in three digit representation? Zero 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 zero. Now we bring our dot. Okay, it, we put it here. Now again, what is one? Similarly, is one zero zero zero. Then we have zero. Oh no, sorry, I meant it. Uh, sorry, the one is one zero zero. Okay, just this. And then the zero is zero zero zero. And then again, the one is one zero zero. You don't have to put this if you want to. Okay. Well, if you, it's up to you. You can put it or not, depending on the question. Sometimes I ask you to work in certain manner. You have to adhere to it. Otherwise, it's, it's up to you. Okay. And here we go. We have our binary. Easy enough? Easy enough? Okay, so don't get tricked. Uh, if I do ask you a question that is a little bit tricky, think about it before you, com before you uh, uh, jump to conclusions. Okay, so uh, let us move on. Again, if you do not, uh, if you do not understand anything, uh, please uh, raise your hand. Okay. All right. Okay, I'll do the opposite here. We'll do the opposite. Now, one zero one point, this is the point, I don't know if you see it, point zero one convert to octal. Here we go. So this is now different. You know it's a binary one, right? Convert it to octal. How would you convert it? Yeah. Good. Now, now it's five point two. Yeah. <laughs> right. Okay. Shall shall we work this out? Okay. We have um, we have one. 
zero point one zero one. Now, uh, can anyone can anyone tell me what we're gonna do? What we're gonna do first? Go on, Munira. Tell me what we what do we do first? Okay. First of all, we had to add uh, zero in the right after comma. Yes. Uh, thank because you. we have. That's fine, yeah, yeah, you answered it well, very well, thank you. Right, yeah, uh, Muna was right, we have, oh, Munira, sorry, we, we have to put, uh, now, now, think about it, we know, I told you before, uh, for example, this number, uh, let's say 3.2, okay, if you put zeros to the, to the left of the, of the, uh, um, of the decimal uh, number, uh, or the integer, uh, it, they are insignificant, okay, uh, similarly, if you put zeros here, also insignificant. They will not change the value. Ah, but here it's quite it's quite important. Don't don't think. Ah, oh, okay then. Um, I don't need to add zero here because they're insignificant. I'll just do this, and this is one. Now this is wrong, right? Because again, the rule is to have three three bits represent binary. So we're gonna have to add a zero here because we have got to work with the three. Okay, so you're going to have to add a zero. I know it's insignificant, but in our rule, we have to, because it will change the answer, and it did. Look, it's no longer one, it's actually two. Okay, it's actually two, right? This number here is easy, it's five, right? Don't forget the decimal, so the, the answer is 5.2 in octal. Understood? Easy? Yeah? Okay, okay, let's uh, take another example. Now, um, okay, uh, this is a good one. Right. Two hundred and six octal to decimal. Give it two minutes to work it. Yeah, first of all, convert it to binary. Again, I don't understand why a to the power of zero. No, 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 no. Yeah, okay, you can, but no, it's uh, this is easier. If you convert to binary first, it will be easier. I, I, I get what you mean. It's, it's also good, but if you convert to binary, it will be easier. Yes, yeah, correct. Okay, let's work it. Again, the thing is, binary is very easy. So uh, we try to avoid all the complication and jump into binary straight away. Uh, okay, so um, six in in binary, it's uh, zero, one, one. I'm gonna write them uh, spread out because we're gonna we're gonna need to to continue. Uh, zero is uh, zero, zero, zero. Two is zero, one, zero. Okay, so uh, we we. we Convert now the, deci the, the binary to decimal. Uh, we have uh, 2 to the power of 0 times 0 plus 2 to the power of 1 times 1 plus 2 to the power of 2 times 1 plus 2 to the power of 3 times 0 plus 2 to the power of of 4 times 0 plus, uh, where are we now, uh, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, okay, uh, 2 to the power of 5 times 0 plus 2, 3, 4, 5, yeah. 2 to the power of 6 times 0 plus 2 to the power of 7 times 1 plus 
Oops. Plus 2 to the power of 8 times uh, 0. Okay, so um, um, it's work it out. So the f the first one here will be different than zero because we times it by uh, multiplying by zero. Plus we're gonna have two. Plus we're gonna have four. Then we're gonna have uh, one, two, three, four zeros. Plus zero. Plus zero. Plus zero. Plus zero. Plus okay, uh, two to the power of seven is hundred and 28 and uh, the last one is also 0 because it's multiplied by 0 uh, the answer should be uh, 128, 130, 134 okay, 100, 134 uh, in decimal is this clear? is this understood? is it? yeah? okay now, okay, let's uh, move on Right. Okay. So uh, this is why this is what I've uh, prepared for you uh, in terms of conversion. So uh, conversion, it's uh, quite easy to do the conversion. Make sure you understand that very well because definitely you will get questions regarding the conversion. Okay. So let's move to the another uh, another topic. Uh, we we work out, we work with the binary operations, binary operations. Open, oops, operations, binary operations. Okay, uh, right. If I um, uh, right, okay, I have to tell you something. I'd like you always with the binary operation, always, always, and remember this in the exam. Always work with. Eight bits. I want you always to work with eight bits when it comes to binary operations. Make sure in the exam you do the same. Now, um, okay. Uh, let me give you uh, just a, a few examples. Now, okay. If I have this number. Uh, if I have number seven, okay. If I have number, if I have, okay. If I have minus seven, okay, in decimal, and I ask you to present it in binary using signed, signed magnitude, signed magnitude. Also, this is one. Also, I want you to represent it using ones complement com and also I want you to present it with in, in using twos complement. Now can you uh, write your answers? Um, how do I present minus seven uh, into using eight bits? Again, always eight bits. Uh, I want you to use eight bits with the binary operations. using 8 bits, not for okay, right, yeah, many, many of you are correct, right, so first of all, before we do the, before we change the, the sign, we need to know what 7 is in binary, 7 is 111, and then again, 111 is enough, but I want you to work in 8 bits, and I'll tell you why in a minute, okay, uh, 3 ones, and we're going to have 5 zeros, one, two, three, four, five. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight bits. So this is number seven. This is number seven in binary, but this is a plus. This is mujab. We want salib. Okay? Salib in the side mag magnitude is easy. The very left bit, uh, the very left bit, you just change it to one. Again, remember when I said to you, zeros are pluses, 
ones are minuses when we work with the uh, with the sign uh, magnitude, okay, or even the ones complement and two complement, right? So we need to change only the very last one to one to do the sign magnitude, and then we have the one, two, three, four zeros, and one, two, three ones. So this is actually now minus seven in um, sign magnitude, right? With the ones complement. What was, can anyone tell me what was the rule in the ones complement? Yeah, we need ourselves it uh, well. Uh, the, the rules of the sign, the sign complement, you make the zeros ones and the ones zeros. Simple, okay? So we can have our uh, five zeros, we can change into ones. One, two, three, four, five. And then the ones will become zeros. Okay, so this is the rule regarding the ones complement. Uh, you change, you make the zeros ones and the ones uh, zeros. Right, uh, regarding the twos complement, how do we uh, make the twos complement? Change all zeros to ones that's uh, in the ones complement, yeah. Uh, what about the twos complement? What is the role for the twos complement? Yeah, after the first one, you have to change the zeros to ones and ones to zeros. Yeah, correct. Yeah, with the two's complement rule, always look for the first one comes. Okay, so if you have zeros, you have gonna you're gonna have to put them. The first one comes, you you uh, you you bring it down, and then you change what's after. So for the seven, okay, look at the first one here. We're gonna have to bring it down according to the rule, and then we change what's after this one. So we have zero, zero, and then five. Ones, one, two, three, four, five. Okay, so this is minus seven now in the two's complement rule. Well, now let's just take uh, take uh, actual operations to make this clearer. Now, if I ask you to, if I ask you to subtract these, oh, subtract these. Numbers 15 in decimal minus 46 in decimal using, in the exam I'll make it clear for you, in the exam I'll tell you what I want you to use. I'll tell you if I want you to, if I want you to use signed or, um, uh, well, normally we use ones or two's complement, so I t I'll tell you wh what I want you to use. So again, you have to read the questions very carefully, okay? Uh, you, uh, use, use ones complement, okay? So I want you to spend two minutes now to, uh, uh, to do 50 minus 46 using the ones complement technique. No, normally I will, thank you, good question, Munira. Normally I will give you the, uh, um, these numbers in decimal, okay, these numbers are normally given to you in decimal and you have to convert them first. So good question, yeah. No, it will not take a long time. If you're comfortable, I'll, I'll show you a way to teach, uh, to, to cheat. I'll, I'll, uh, I'll give you a cheating way to do it, it will, it will save you time. I'll give you. Just be patient. Any luck? Now let me change the battery on my mobile while you think about the problem. I'm talking to the groove. I'm talking to the groove. <laughs>
when you look In which type? What do you mean in which type? I want to choose one's complement, but I don't understand what you mean in which type. I did, I did say it, one's complement. There we go. Okay, yeah, let's start, start getting some answers. Okay. Yeah. Um, Zahra, you are almost, almost there. Okay, let's 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 uh, let's work together. Let's let me uh, let me do it for you. Well, okay. So uh, uh, first of all, I'll, I'll teach you a way to um, uh, to to find the binary. Uh, I will only allow you to do this this method when you come to operations. But if I ask you to actually convert, you have to do the proper conversion. Okay. But for this uh, method, just to to get it uh, easy for you, to uh, to change quickly from decimal to binary, I have a trick for you. What you do, set a scale for you. Uh, right, where shall I do it? Okay, I'll, I'll do it here. Okay, set a scale for you, oops, uh, that goes from one, okay, and, and, and this one will, will become uh, double and double. So you have one, two, four, eight, sixteen, thirty-two, 64 and 128. Again, I would only allow you to use this, okay, when it comes to operations. But if I ask you to convert, proper conversion, you have to do the proper way. But this is a cheating way, just uh, for you to speed, speed things up. Now, now think about uh, what numbers out of these, the ones I've just written, <coughs> the ones I've just written now, what numbers make 50? Now, we can think about it. We have, we need 32. 16, that's 48, and we need 2. These three numbers will make 50. So we have them 1 and the rest zeros. Easy? Here we go, that's 50. Easy? Did you get this? Yeah, did you get it? Did you understand it? Yes, you understand it? Very good. Okay. So, yeah, good, good. So this is 50. Now, we need, this is 50, okay, this is 50. Now, we need to uh, uh, to convert the next number as well using the same method. Now, what do you need for 50, 46? Obviously, we need 32, and uh, we need 8, that's 40, and we need uh, 4 and 2. So, 32 and 8, that's 40, 44, 46, the rest will go zeros. 0, 0, 0, 0. And we have, we have ourselves uh, uh, 46. Now, what do we need to do next? What do we need to do next? Add one. What do you mean add one? Yeah, we need to yeah, convert to uh, to one's complement. We need to con to convert to one's complement. Okay. What do we what do we convert to one's complement? Which number to convert to one's complement? The 46, is, of course, because it is the minus one. Okay, so we need to convert. Let's do the conversion again. With the worst complement, zeros become ones and ones become zeros. So we have, we have uh, one, zero, 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 one, zero, one, one. Okay, so this is the uh, one. Okay, so I run out of the space. So allow me to use another page. Uh, to, to do the, um, the calculations. Okay, so uh, the, the 50, we bring it as it is. Uh, we have zero, zero, uh, one, one, I have everything here, zero, zero, uh, and we have uh, one, zero, so that's uh, that's for the 50. Then we need to bring the, the number that we just converted to, to one's complement. It was uh, one, one, 
zero one. Okay. Now what do we do? Do we subtract them? Yeah, we add them. Zahra answered me for us. Yeah, we add them now. We do not subtract because we already converted the second number to uh, its uh, complement. So we do addition. No addition. Okay. So we'll have 1. 0 plus 1 is 1. 1 plus 0 is 1. Uh, and then we have 0 plus 0 is 0. 0 plus 0 is 0. 1 plus 1. What's 1 plus 1? 1 plus 1 is 0. And we carry 1. 1 plus 1. In binary, it's not two. We're talking about binary, not two. Okay, one plus one is zero, and the carry is one. And one plus one is again zero, and the carry one. One plus one again is zero, and the carry one. One plus one ah uh, zero, and obviously carry one is going to come down here. What do we have here? What do we have? Overflow, yes, thank you. Now with the overflow, what do we do? If the one, when we have overflow in one's complement, what do we do with it? We add it, yes. So how do I know it's overflow? How do I, how do I know it's an overflow? How do I know this is an overflow? Yes, it's a ninth bit. Uh, here we go. Which is why I said to you, we always try to work in eight bits to have our work consistent and we have no problems. Okay, so if you have a ninth bit, you know it's an overflow. So let's count them. We have, uh, this is one number, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. This is the ninth uh, uh, number uh, bit, so it's an overflow. We need to add it here. So remember, this is the rule. And this only applies with the one's complement only. Okay, we'll come to talk about the two's complement. With the one's complement only, if we have an overflow, we add it back to the number. So let's do the addition. 1 plus 1 is 0 and k1. 1 plus 1 is 0 and the k1. And then you have 1 here. And then 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, Okay, we have a nice eight bits. Now you tell me, what is this number? It's four. Mujib or Salib? Mujib or Salib? A plus, yes. It's a plus, not Salib. It's a Mujib, not Salib. No, it's a Mujib. Why it's Mujib? Look at the result. We have zero at the very, at the very left. So I told you always, when you have, you look at the, at the very left bit, if it's a zero, it's a plus. If it's a one, it's a minus. So it's a plus, right? So it's easy. So straight away, we have four in decimal. Now go back, if you want to double check, you make, you make sure that you, you answer this correctly. Go back, right? In, in decimal, 50 minus 46, what's the answer? It's four, right? So this is a good way to check. Here we go, we got four. Right, another problem. So I'm, I'm worried that we might actually run out of time uh, here because I have uh, quite a lot of, uh, you know, only in one hour I finished two pages and I've prepared, I think, nine pages for you. So I'm, I'm worried that we, we won't uh, have time. So we'll, uh, we'll push on. Right, so uh, this one, right, now uh, also if I say to you, right, uh, let's do, let's do 62 in decimal minus 70, all also using one's complement. Okay? Give you two minutes, try this, also using one's complement. I cannot take my time, I have a lecture at 8 o'clock. Okay, let's do, let's do the 62. Uh, going back to our scale, I'm not going to write it again. I have the number written here already, uh, but you know how to, how to work uh, with the scale that I showed you. Uh, the 62 will become 0, 0, 1, 1, 1, 
uh, one one five ones and wave yeah and then uh, zero okay so this is the uh, 62 62 in binary now the 70 I'm gonna work it on the side the 70 is uh, one zero zero one 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 zero one but this is again this is a plus 70 we need to change it to minus 70 we need to uh, switch so we have uh, uh, zero one one zero 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 one zero we bring this number here yeah? zero one one zero 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 one zero okay we add these uh, numbers together um okay let me show go for, oh no hang on zero one one No, uh, hang on, hang on. I um, yeah, um, I think I've um, I made a mistake here. Hang on, oh, sorry. I do apologize. Um, yeah, yeah. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No problem. Uh, sorry, I've uh, I can't find the Just hang on, hang on. Uh, right, the seventy. It's um, yeah, that's sixty-four. Yep. Sorry, I do apologize. Right, okay, just. Ignore this. Sorry, um, the the seventy is uh, zero one one. Sorry, I got it right here. Sorry, one one um, zero 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 one zero. Okay, I cannot repeat the cheating. Uh, well, I'll I'll I'll, I'll 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 tell you how to cheat again. Okay, I'll I'll repeat the other slide. Uh, right. So okay, sorry. So it's uh, zero one one. Yeah, I got it right here. Uh, no, I did not. Right. So I need to change it to. Um, to was complemented is gonna come like this one 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 zero one okay so sorry I'm gonna have to change these one zero uh, this would become zero this is one sorry about the mess this is one this is one this is zero and this is one sorry about the mess this is the penalty of uh, looking at my uh, notes if I worked it from head I wouldn't have this problem. Uh, right. Okay. Right. So I think this is uh, well. Should be should be uh, readable enough. Okay. So let's let's do the uh, the addition. Uh, zero plus one is uh, one. One plus zero is one. Uh, one plus zero is one. One plus one is zero, and the carry is one. Okay. One plus one plus one. What is it? Yeah. One and the carry is one. Okay, when you have one plus one plus one, you have one and the carry is one. Again, one plus one plus one, you have a one and the carry is one. One plus zero, zero is one, and then you have one here. Okay, uh, I think this should be correct. But okay, can you tell me what this what was this was this number? What's the uh, what's the format of this number? Yeah, it is. Uh, it is solid. Okay, so obviously it's not going to give us the real number. Now, if you see the eighth bit, the eighth bit one, the eighth bit is one. It means that it, this is still in in the ones complement format. We need to change it back to binary, but we have to remember the sign. So what we're going to have to do is is change it back because this is now in the ones complement format. We need to change it back, change it back to binary. So we have the zero. Zero zero one zero 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 zero. We even change this, right? And in oh, oh, oops, what am I doing? Uh, sorry, it's in uh, in binary. And this equals now. Okay, what is this number? What is the number? It's eight, right? And then this is eight. And then you just gonna have to rem remember your sign from the original figure uh, number, and you're gonna have to bring it down here. Okay, so you have a minus. Eight in decimal. Is this understood? Is this understood? Yes. Okay. It's understood. Excellent. Now uh, the one who asked me, um, how do we cheat? Now this is how we cheat. Uh, if I ask you, for example, to change fifty from decimal to binary, instead of do the, doing the, the division, and again, this I will only allow you to do this when it comes to binary operations. But if I ask you to convert, if I ask you to convert. Okay, remember, if I ask you to convert decimal to binary, you have to do the division way. Okay, but if I if I ask you to do the normal operations, I ask you to uh, I I will allow you to cheat. Uh, you will have the what you do. 
have a scale that go from that go from one to hundred and twenty eight. It goes in multiples. So you're gonna have the first number one. Okay, then what's the double of that is 2, then 4, then 8, then 16, then 32, then 46, then 64, then 128. They go in double. Now find uh, which numbers make up the 50, for example. Okay, what numbers out of these numbers that you have in front of you, what do they make, what, what the numbers make up 50? We have, we need 32, we need 16, and we need 2. These three numbers will will make the number fifty. So we need to have them as ones, okay? Meaning switch them on. We need them ones, and the rest we have them as zeros. Simple enough. Is this, uh, just, uh, just clear? No, I will only allow you to do it this way when it comes to. Are you are you listening well? I will only allow you to do this way when it comes to operations. If I ask you to specifically convert, you have to do the division Y, okay? The last time, right, okay. So let's uh, move on to the next example. <clears throat> okay, right. Now, try this. 55, obviously it's in decimal, minus 50 in decimal, using this time to lose complement. This time use to lose complement. So go on, give you two minutes. Okay, let me um, okay, let me help you now because again I've, I've got so many other stuff to show you and um, I don't want to run out of time. Um, right, okay. Uh, quickly, uh, I've already got 55. Um, uh, um, I've already done it before. Right, I've got it in here. It's uh, zero zero uh, one one zero one one one. Okay, now on the side, I'm going to do the 50. We've just done it uh, not long ago. Uh, it's 0, 0, we said 1, 1, uh, 0, 0, 1, uh, 0. Um, yeah, okay. Now to, ch to, to change to two's complement, what do we need to do? As uh, someone said before, we need to bring the first one from, we, we, we move along until we reach the first one from the right. We bring it down and then we continue flipping the next. So what's going to happen, uh, what's going to happen here is obviously we have a zero, it's a zero, so we bring it down. Now we have, uh, here we go, this is the first one, we also bring it down, then we convert, we, we change what's, uh, what's uh, 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 you know, the, the, the one uh, behind. So we're going to have uh, 1, 1, 0, 0, 1, 1. Now we bring the one number here, 0, 1, 1, 1, 0, 0, 1, 1, and we do our addition, 1 plus 0 is, uh, is 1, um, 1 plus 1 is, uh, sorry, is 0, and the carry 1, 1 plus 1 plus 1 is 1, and the carry is 1, 1 plus 1 is 1, and the carry 1, 1 plus 1 is 1, and, oh, what am I doing, sorry, 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 I do apologize, uh, this is uh, 0, and the carry 1, 1 plus 1 again is 0, and the carry 1, 1 plus 1 is 0, and the carry 1, 1 plus 1 is 0, and the carry 1, 1 plus 1 is 0 and the carry 1. Again, look, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. 9. So we have, uh, we have an overflow again. What do we do with this overflow? Ignore it. Yes, well done. So in the twos, in the twos complement, we ignore the overflow. Unlike the ones complement. So uh, thank you. You know, show that you've been, you've been doing some revision. Very good.
Okay, so we ignore it, unlike the ones complement. The ones complement, we use it again. We add it, but with the two's complement, we ignore it. So what do we do now? What do we do now? That's it. Yeah, exactly. We we finished. Okay, because look, the eighth number is zero, so it's positive. Okay, and what do we have here? We have five. So the answer straight. Okay, this is in, in binary. The answer straight is plus five in decimal again. 55 minus 50 is plus 5. Okay, so this is good. Okay, let's uh, do another one. Uh, well, last one uh, with the operations because I need to move on to another subject. Uh, now, um, if we have uh, 62 in, um, in decimal minus 64 also in decimal, uh, work it using the tools complement. Okay, right. Let's uh, let's um, uh, let's um, get started on it. So uh, the 62 is uh, oops. The 62 is uh, zero zero, and then we have one, two, three, four, five, and we have a zero. Now uh, the 64 is, is easy enough. It's uh, zero one, and then uh, six uh, zeros. Okay. Now uh, interesting. Now we need to change this to. Um, uh, to this complement again, all these are zeros. You can have to bring them down. One, two, three, four, five, six. Now we look at the first one. We bring it down and change what is after it. Okay, so this time you can only change one one uh, bit. Okay, we have this again here: zero, 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 zero one, one. Okay, we do addition. 0 plus 0 is 0, 1 plus 0, and then 1, 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 and then 1. Easy. Okay? Now look at the eighth number. What is it? It's minus. So what do we do with it? What do we do? Convert. Yes. So this this uh, this number we because it's, it's still in two's complement format. We need to change it back to its original. So again, we're going to have to uh, do exactly the opposite. So we bring the zero, we bring the first one, and change what's left. One, two, three, four, five, six, right? So this is uh, in, uh, in binary again. So what do, what's this equal to? It's two, OK, but. We, we must not forget this. We must bring it here. So we have minus 2 in decimal. OK? Is this understood? Any question? Any question? No questions? OK, so these are the conver the conver we did the conversions and we did the uh, binary operations. Quite easy, right? You just need to uh, practice. You can go to the net. If you want to, you can go to the back the book. I think the book has uh, has a uh, few exercises as well. Uh, you can check the net um, and uh, you know just uh, practice them. Okay, you'll de you'll definitely get uh, operation question definitely. All right, okay. So um, okay, let me get a new, open a new page, another subject. Okay, we have a quick question, Munira. Uh, yeah, go on, ask me. Uh, uh, Victor, I would like to ask you. Um, the um, the last operation we do is uh, zero one 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 one. It's minus two, yeah. And yeah. when when we convert it, it's the uh, opposite. It's a positive number. Yeah, it's it's this, no, okay. Now we cannot we cannot leave this like this. It's not a positive number. It's a negative number. But the thing is, the computer will not allow us to leave this in this format because this is an error. Now uh, look at this. Does this does this equal to minus two in binary? Ah, uh, no. It doesn't. Okay, okay. It is minus. But look at this number. 
Okay, it's it's not it's certainly not not two. Okay, so we need to change it to the correct number. Now this is correctly two, but we must not forget the sign. The sign we have to we have to carry it over with us. So we we show it we show it as zero, but we remember it is minus. Is okay, correct? if it's uh, if it's coming as uh, positive and the answer will have You're to leaving. be minus, I have to convert it. That's what you mean. Say that again. Say that again. Uh, yeah. Okay. No, say that again. Sorry. Say say that again. Okay. If the answer have to be negative and the answer with with the adding, it's positive. I have to convert it to come negative. That's what you mean. No. Always when you have when you have a zero at the end and it's not overflow. It's not an overflow. When you have a real zero at the very left. That means the number is positive. Leave it as it is. Oh, sorry, no, no, sorry, sorry. Okay. I mean, if if the if the if the uh, number, if the digit, if the bit, on the on the eighth bit, not the overflow, the eighth bit. If it is zero, it means the number is positive. Leave it as it is. That's it. This is the answer. Okay. Now, if the eighth number is one. It means that the number is negative. Okay, we need to change it back to its original format and carry the sign of do not forget the salad. Is this clear? Okay. Is yeah, clear? Yeah, okay. Okay. Thank okay. you. Yeah. We have a question from uh, Maimona. Okay, go on. Uh, yes, hello, teacher. I want to ask you if we want to change the uh, from uh, 62 to binary. Uh, we have uh, to take a long time because uh, we never uh, do it. So uh, when I want to uh, change uh, from uh, 62 from uh, uh, to binary, I will take long time, even if one uh, number only. Now, uh, I don't know if you joined us uh, late, Maimuna. I just explained this. Now, if I ask you to convert, if I ask you specifically to convert decimal to binary, you have to do it the long way, which is the division. Otherwise, if it's just an operation like what we're doing now, uh, you could use my cheating method. Now, for the, for the last time, I'm going to explain it. Right? What you do, this is a simple way to, to do this. Uh, uh, write, write the numbers from 1 to 128 going into multiples. So write 1 to begin with, okay, and then uh, and then uh, the uh, d double the 1 is 2, double the 2 is 4, double the 4 is 8, and so on until you reach 128. Now, for example, if we have the number 50, Okay, now think about the numbers that make up the 50. We have 32, we have 16, and we have 2 make up 50. Have those ones to be, have those uh, numbers to be ones, and the rest are zeros. Now you have yourself 50 in binary. Easy enough? Easy enough? How would you caught us? We use the cheating way. No, no, that's fine. it's not a cheating. It's it's fine. It's fine. Okay. It's, I'm not saying to you uh, you're not allowed to. I'm I'm saying to you use my simple method only in the when doing the operations. That's fine. It's perfectly fine. I will not penalize you for that. So use this method the easy way. Let's call. Okay. Don't forget. It. We will not say cheating. So you don't get panic. It's not cheating. Let's say let's call it the easy method. Okay. So use my easy method. In doing the uh, the operations, plus, minus, multiplication, and so on, but use the long method if I specifically say to you uh, say to you convert. إذا إذا أنا إذا أنا حكيت لكم convert, okay, decimal to binary, استخدموا قسمة, okay. If I if I just ask you to do normal not normal operations, use my easy method. اتفقنا. It will, it will, this is enough. Okay. Munira again. Yeah, go on. 
بس دكتور ابغى اسالك بالنسبه لما قلت لنا converting from octal to decimal انت قلت اي هاف تو انه امزح احولها للباينري طيب لو اني سويت هالطريقتي اني ملتبلاي باي 8 اتس اوكي ولا اي هاف تو دو وات يو تيتش اس لا 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 صح ذس از اوكي ذس از اوكي از لونج از يو جيت ذا رايت انسر اول اول ذس فاين وذا يو يو وذا يو تانس باي 8 اور يو 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 هاف ذا ديسيمال سوري هاف ذا باينري از انتيميديت ستيب بوث كوركت Okay, thank you, Dr. Okay, uh, question from uh, Mona. Yeah? Mona? Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum assalam. I want to ask you if you have a question from the one's complement to uh, just in adding. When I start with the other flow, in the other flow, what do I do? Do I ignore it or not? أضيف للناس مرة ثانية. شكرا. Very good question actually. It's a very very good question. That's the sign. Yeah. If you have an overflow in a normal addition, you use it as part of the answer. لأنه فكر في الموضوع. It's a very good question. Very good question actually. Right. Let me find an empty space here. Okay. I'll use this. Actually, I'll use this. Okay, uh, now فكروا في الموضوع. Now, uh, what is the eighth bit? The eighth, the eighth bit is no, it's, it's 128. صح? The eighth bit. Now, what if I ask you to add, um, I don't know, uh, to add uh, 70 to 80. Okay, add them normally. You will get 150. So, obviously, you will have overflow, which you will have to use as part of your answer, as part of the number. Okay, so, yeah, thank you. منيرة يا أو نو أم أو شيء زغم أوكي بس let me let me I'll continue because we have too much too much to do we've only got forty minutes left right chapter four you need to know the little man computing the diagram of the little man computing you need to understand the diagram you also need to understand the operations simple operations are you comfortable with it if I ask you to use a calc if I ask you if I if I give you a scenario that you need to add or subtract numbers on the calculator can you do the steps yeah Okay, I'll give you, I'll give you a quick, a quick, um, uh, I'll give you a quick method. Right, okay, um, so if I ask you using the little, if I specify to you using the little man computing, do the following: five plus eight minus two. What would you do? Quickly. Obviously, we're gonna have. Okay, this is the number. Okay. Work it uh, on your own paper. Okay, uh, we have the box here, which is uh, the counter. We have the assembly here. And we have the code. Okay, we, you need to have a table like this. Normally, I will give you the table, so you need to, you need to fill it. Okay, right, let, uh, let me do this. So the first step, 0, 1, the first step, uh, we need to have input. Okay? We need to have input. Okay, what is the input? Uh, what's the code for the input? What's the code for the input? 901, yeah. Okay? We need to have an input, which is obviously number 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 5. Now, um, uh, then we need to store the number 5. So the next step, we need to store number 5. Now, I give you where to store it, for example. So, if I say store 14, I mean store to location 14. I normally give you the location. Okay? Store to location 14. Right? Uh, what is the uh, symbol for the store? Thank you. Yes, 314. Well, well done, well done. Good. It uh, shows that you're doing revision. Excellent. Okay, 314. Now, what do we do next? What do we do next? We, have, uh, we don't add just yet. We need to have another input. Okay, we add when we talk about the um, when we talk about the uh, um, the address uh, machines. Okay, but with the simple simple little man computing, uh, we need to have another number, which is number eight this time. Okay, uh, the code for it is nine zero one. 
okay because because the five is no longer here the five is moved to location 14 right so we can have 901 um, which is, which holds num number eight so the fourth step will be adding adding 14 that's right yes adding 14 oh no the cause for add is uh, not two is one okay thank you yeah it's one 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 four Okay, two is for subtraction. So we have one, one, four. So now we add in uh, number five to eight. The fifth the step uh, will be storing the result. Okay, let's uh, give you a location 20, for example. So what do we have now? Okay, what do we have as the code for storing 320? Yeah, 320. Now we have our last input, which is uh, number two. Uh, which is the sixth uh, operation? We need to have input. Uh, okay, it's uh, nine zero one, right? The seventh step. What will the seventh step be? Sub. Yeah, thank you. We do the sub. Now the sub uh, is uh, uh, well. Let's say uh, sub. Obviously, sub what? Sub what? Sub what? So eight, eight, why eight? Think about it. Sub what? Twenty. Yes. Thank you. Finally, right. Don't forget when we added these numbers, the the five and the eight. Where did we store them? We store them in location twenty. So now you now you need to sub subtract whatever whatever is in in location twenty. So sub twenty. So you're gonna have you're gonna have uh, twenty minus the new input. Uh, so not 20. I mean, sorry. I mean the location 20. Whatever the value, it, uh, the value is uh, 13. The value is 13 inside inside address 20. So you're gonna do sub 20, which means that you're gonna bring whatever is in, in in location 20 subtracted uh, or subtract the input from it. So we have the 220. We have 220. That's right. Okay. Then what do we do after that? Number eight, what do you do after that? Output, yeah. You need to have an output. What is the code for that? Nine, zero, two. What do you do next? What do we do next? Halt. Well done. Actually, you're very good. Okay. Halt. H O T. Uh, the code for it is zero, zero, zero. Simple. Simple. Yeah? No? Maybe? Yes, okay. Right. Let's continue. Okay, this might be a little bit... Um, okay, okay, I'm going to test you on this. Now think about this problem. Okay, so uh, lecture five, uh, this was lecture four. Lecture five, you need to understand the assembly language. Uh, I might give you a code and ask you to give me the instructions um, in the assembly language. Okay, so if I give you, for example, this code, uh, okay, let me write it here. If I give you this code, uh, variable C equals zero, uh, variable A equals uh, zero, variable B, equals 2, okay, um, then I we open a method, we can use begin if I wanted to, but I open a method and I say while, for example, while, while a less than 5 loop, I mean, we have, we have a loop here, okay, um, we have C, by the way, whoever is studying um, CS140, we'll, we'll be talking about loops this, this week. Uh, okay, so if we have, if I say to you, okay, C equals A plus B, are you thinking about the problem? And then I say to you, A equals A plus 1. Okay, these are semicolon. These are semicolon, right? So these are semicolon. Uh, then I um, end the loop and loop 
and then uh, we end uh, the to the uh, the method. Right? Okay. Um, um, okay. I'm just gonna just gonna put a line here so it can work here. So here we're gonna have um, we're gonna have the uh, box. Okay. We're gonna have the code. We're gonna have the code. Oops. And we're gonna have the assembly. Assembly. Oh, my pen is. Yes. Uh, are you thinking about the problem? No, I didn't mention it in my way. Ah, طبعا. Of course, I will. Yeah, of course, I will. Uh, I will specify which way. This is not the little man way. I'm giving you a code, and I'm asking you to find the instructions using the assembly language. Okay, before you load, let us think about this loop. When I say to you, a smaller than five, what do I actually mean? Remember, what is the initial value of a? What is the initial value of a? Ah, initial value of a is zero. Okay, yeah. it's from zero to four. It's the initial value is zero. It goes up to four. So, how many values do we have? How many values? Uh, yeah, five values. So, if I if I do this instead, uh, okay, I, um, I write it here. Okay, if I if we have uh, if I have this instead, will it be the same? If I say a, a minus 5 equals equals 0, yes, it will be the same. Okay, I'm, I'm talking about how many how many numbers do I have? Okay, it goes from 0 to uh, to 4 because it has to be less than less than 5. So I have 0. 1, 2, 3, 4, 4, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, so I have 5, uh, five um, numbers, okay, so if I subtract, if I subtract the 5 from A, okay, we get 0, we get an initial value of A, so it's correct, okay, yeah, so because we do not have, in this instruction, we do not have, we do not have the symbol, which is the, um, uh, 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 less than or or, uh, or greater than. So you're gonna have to do it this way. Ah, by the way, if we have the opposite, if we have let's say, uh, okay, if I say to you, if I say to you A is actually, if I say to you A is five, okay, not zero. A is five, and A is greater than zero, okay. Uh, what we will what we'll have to do? Yeah, so it's from one so from um, it's from one to five, that's right. Yeah. Why it but the the first one, okay. Forget. Right, let's talk about let's talk about the first one. The first one, the initial value is zero, and we're saying a is less than five. Okay, so uh, a can go from zero to four. How many digits we have, or how many? Um, what's the maximum? Of, what's the maximum number we can have for four? Uh, for for a is four. So we have so a can be either zero, one, two, three, or four. So we have five. Uh, uh, possibilities, five possibilities. So instead, we can have a minus five equals equals zero. Okay, because fi a have, has five possibilities, right? Now the opposite applies. If I say to you the initial value is five, but this time this time is a, this time a is greater than zero. So the the values of a can go from can go from uh, one or can go down actually can go down from five because initial value from five to one. How many characters do we have? Five, three, two, one. Four characters. Okay. Uh, hang on, five, four, three, two, one. Sorry, five characters. We can go five. It's five characters. Five, 
four, three, two, one. So we can do the opposite. We can say, hang on, hang on. We can say, um, we can say, a minus five will equal to zero. Is the exact? Oh, sorry. No, 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 no. Sorry. Uh, sorry, 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 sorry. Hang on. No. We don't want zero. Um, okay, five. A plus five. Okay, yeah, sorry. A plus five equals zero. Because we have five characters, okay, that will that will get us to zero. We have the five, okay? We have the five, the four, the three, the two, the one. We have five characters or five numbers before we get to uh, zero. Where is the, where, where the, uh, before we get to zero. This time is decrement. This time is decrement. Confused? Why? Simple. Right. Forget about the second one. Okay, let's talk about the first one. Okay, we have the initial the initial value of A is, Z, is, is zero. The initial value of A is zero. Now I'm saying to you, A is less than five. So how many characters? How many characters? Okay, so I have Arabi. Okay. طيب عندنا عندنا الخمسة تبدأ بالصفر. ها وأعلى قيمة للخمسة أعلى قيمة للأي أي أي تبلش صفر. أعلى قيمة للأي هي أربعة. كم رقم للأي ممكن يصير عندنا محتمل؟ خمسة. صفر واحد اثنين ثلاثة أربعة. خمسة. أوكي يعني خمس احتمالات للأي. طيب إذا حكيت أي ناقص خمسة تساوي تساوي صفر دسم. من ناحية الاحتمالات من ناحية الاحتمالات كم احتمال عندي خمسة شيل الخمسة هذول من أي إيش صفي عندي صفي عندي شيل خمسة احتمالات من أي الآن سفري سفري تفصل 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 ما بين هذه وما بين ما بين اللوب أنا نحكي الاحتمالات كم احتمال صفر أوكي نفس المبدأ الثاني أوكي إذا حكيت طيب إذا حكيت طيب عندي نبدأ الانيشال فاليو القيمة الأولية لـ A هي خمسة تمام؟ القيمة الأولية لـ A خمسة طيب بس الآن عندي ديكريمنت خمسة أكبر من صفر يعني ديكريمنت يعني تناقص تناقصيا معناتها راح أمشي من خمسة لواحد خمسة أربعة ثلاثة اثنين واحد أيضا عندي خمس قيم أوكي أيضا عندي خمس قيم ف معناته يحتاج لي خمس خطوات حتى اصل الصفر خمس خطوات حتى اصل الصفر فاحكي اي زائد خمسه حتى توصلني للصفر مفهومه مفهومه تينك بعض الخطوات الخطوات احتمالات confusing still مش جمع عادي انا ما عاد احكي جمع ما عاد احكي جمع هنا عاد احكي احتمالات انا ما صح انا ما عاد احكي جمع هنا افصلوا عاد احكي الان احتمالات اوكي كم احتمال عندي يوصلني لو كانت الاي القيمه الاوليه خمسه واحكي لكم انه اي اكبر من صفر كم احتمال عندي لاي قبل ما اصل صفر خمس احتمالات فاي زائدا خمسه تساوي لي صفر يعني خمسه اربعه ثلاثه اثنين واحد لحتى اصل صفر اوكي والعكس صحيح لو حكيت طيب القيمة الأولية لأي هي صفر القيمة الأولية لأي هي صفر طيب لكنه أي أصغر من خمسة كم مر كم احتمال عندي لأي حتى أصل خمسة حتى أصل خمسة طبعا خمسة مش انكلودد خمس احتمالات صفر نبدأ من صفر صفر واحد اثنين ثلاثة أربعة خمس احتمالات فلو شلت الخمس احتمالات من أي اوكي يساوي لي صفر يعني صفرنا صفرنا العداد صفرنا العداد طلعنا من ال... طلعنا من اللوب اوكي طيب let me let's continue and hope they will understand it here let's continue اوكي ما هي مشكلة ما هي مشكلة معلش يعني هو هو كود هذا يعني احنا عندنا شوية كودينج في ال في ال اي تي 110 ما هي مشكلة طيب طيب نشوف ال نشوف طريقة البرمجة أم Okay, when we say 
طبعا فرقت باقي سنو فرقت باقي السكند ميثود ليتس توك اباوت ذا فيرست وان اوكي ذا سكند ذا سكند وان از اولسو امبورتنت بس ثينك اباوت ات اي وونت تو ثينك اباوت ات ات هوم سو ليتس ستيك تو ذا فيرست وان ناو رايت سو وين وي ساي اي ايكوالز اي بلس وان وات دو يو مين وين وي ساي اي ايكوالز اي بلس وان وات دو يو مين increment زيادة هذه في موضوع اللوب you will take the loop this week بال CS هذه زيادة يعني اوكي حسبت لي الاي من كانت صفر خلصنا المسد هذه jump on to the next one add one to a so we gonna so the initial so what's the initial after we finish the first loop what's the initial value for a no When we finish the first loop, yeah, exactly, Amal. The new initial value for A will be one. See, we're working in loops, okay? So which is why, which is why. So basically, we have five loops. We have five loops before we exit the method. We're gonna work with one. Once we finish with one, we're gonna have to. Sorry, sorry. We're gonna work with zero. Once we finish the zero, we're gonna work with one. Once we finish the one, we're gonna work with two. Once we finish the two, we're gonna work with three. Once we finish the three, we're gonna work with Four. So we have five loops before we terminate, before we finish. Okay. Right. The zero is included. Sorry, we start from zero. We start from zero. Right. Let's uh, let's uh, see how we can work this. We have 20 minutes and, and, and another so many examples. Right. Let's work this. Uh, the first one, what the first code will be? What will the first code will be? Load. Yes, that's right. Load. Uh, load what? Load what? Load what? No, 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 not number. Load. Load. A. Yes, that's right. Okay, we're gonna have to work. Uh, no, sorry. Yeah, load A. We're gonna have to work with this. Okay. Load A. Okay. Load A. So I'll tell you, for example, where A is stored. So you're gonna have to put five, which is the symbol for load. And 10 is the address. I will give you the address in the exam. I will give you the address. Right. Okay. So the assembly for it is load LDA load A. This A. After this, what do we do? Subtract. What's the symbol for subtraction? It's 2. Let's say I give you 14 for it. Just 14. So subtract. Subtract what? Subtract what? Five. Well done. Subtract five. So we finish the first sentence. We we have finished the first sentence. So this worked out this for us. Okay? We finished the loop bit. So now we come inside the loop. Right. What's uh, so to 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 get inside the loop? What do we do? Branch, yes, branch zero to be precise. Uh, it's number seven. It's seven, yes, well done. Branch zero, excellent. Let's say it's 16. I'll give you the address for it, 16. We need to branch, meaning we get inside the loop. So it's branch zero. Branch Z, branch zero, okay? It's meaning that we are getting inside the loop, right? What is the next step? What's the next step? Uh, yeah, for, that's fine. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, whoever, sorry, I'm confused with the four you said. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, we have five. Now, what do we need to do? We need to work with this one now. Okay, so we need to uh, load A. Now, where is A? Where is A? Ah, excellent. Now I do not need to give you the address because it's already given here. So you need to load A from the same address. Well done. So load A. Load A. Okay. Right. What do we need to do after loading A? What do we need to do? We need to add. Yes, we need to add. No, not, not yet. We need to add. 
Okay. Well, well, we need to add uh, B, but it's not like it's not like the little man computing where we have to where we have to uh, get B as an input. B B in this code is stored already, so we can directly. It's not like an input. It's already there, so we need directly to to add to it. Okay. So we say one, and let's say B is stored in thirteen. I'll give you again. I'll give you this address. Okay, and you just straight add. You 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 put in here. Add B, okay, which is this B. Add it. After you add the B, what do we do next? A store. Well done. Store, which is which is a three. Store C. Well done. Well done. We need to store C. Well, that's fantastic. So if I give you the location to store, I'll give you, for example twenty one. So okay. So now we need to store C. What do we do next? Load. Load what? Load A from where? We need to load A from where? Load, you know, yeah, it's not 410, it's 510. Yeah, well done. It's 510. Again, we need to load A because think about it. We have not changed the location of, of A. If we change it later, ah, you have to access the new location. But so far, we have not changed the location of A. So it is, it is 10. Okay, so you use again 510. Okay, load A. Load A. What are do, what, what, what we doing now? We're doing this now. Okay, we're doing this now. Load A. Then what do we do? Add one. So let's say I give you or seven. I give you location seven for one, for example. So you need to add one, right? After this, what do we do? Store a. Okay. Uh, sorry. It's, um, uh, what are we doing? Um, oh no, we don't, we don't need to. Store, that's how we finished. We do not need store a. We can just uh, uh, end the loop. Okay, because um, um, well, actually, you can if you want to. Although we finish, we can if you want to. Okay, so let's say so we can if you want. It's up to you. Okay, we do not have to because we have finished. Okay, we have finished. We can uh, you can store it if you want to. Let's say uh, it's up to you. Let's say let's say we overwrite it. We store it to ten. Okay, so uh, sorry, it will be uh, five or five ten. Uh, sorry, three ten. Okay, so not store 310, right? And we say store A. But we do not have to store it because we have finished, we, we ended the loop. So we end the loop. Um, we need to br branch out. Okay, so number 10 will be branch out. Uh, so it's 601, always 601, branch out. So just uh, BR. What do we mean? We have finished the loop, branch out. Okay, now branch out. If there is anything left, we have to execute it. We have to continue. But in this example, there is nothing left, so we halt. Eventually, I don't have a place to write it. I will write it here. I will write here. Number eleven. I don't sorry. I made a big mess. Number eleven will be zero 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 halt. Okay. If we have something outside the loop, we have to continue. Okay, and uh, whatever is inside the loop will be an input to it. Okay, is this is this clear? Right. I want you to. Uh, yeah, I hope it's clear. Work it yourself. If you do not understand, my email is. Uh, some of you look confused. Uh, try it yourself. Try to understand it. Right, because I've I've only got ten minutes, and I need. I've got more examples to show you. Uh, try it. If you do not understand it, either ask your first lecturer or email me. Uh, I will answer your emails this week. So email me if you have a problem. Now, I'll tell you what. We don't have enough time left. What I will do, uh, instead of uh, giving you this, I have an exercise for you. It's quite important, actually. Right, OK, I'll tell you what. Uh, uh, I wanted to finish the session. Uh, okay, right. Okay, I'll tell you. What, I'll yeah. I'm, I'm, the problem is, I have. Let me think.
Um, sorry, I'm just trying to think because this is quite important. I don't want to leave it. But, um, when is the uh, when is your CS? Uh, when is your CS? When is your CS session? Do you all take CS with me? Do you all take CS with me? I know some other yeah, yeah. That's a problem now. By the way, uh, yeah, I do apologize for people who have math uh, on on um, on Wednesday. حقيقة والله جدا يعني الأسبوع هذا very full. الأسبوع هذا very very full. فما راح أقدر أغير موعد ال موعد ال الأربعاء. الأربعاء. I'm trying, <laughs> I'm trying to think now. Think. I just need to see my. Since I again, it's just like so many that I have a very, a very busy week. Uh, Tuesday, you have uh, most of you have lectures. I think on Tuesday, is that right? I'll tell you what. Uh, okay, okay, okay. What? Well, uh, okay, no, this is going to be complicated. Yeah, is there, is anyone can can anyone help me? Your suggestion? Uh, yeah, go on. You have a suggestion? You have a suggestion? قدم قدم وقت وصف بس الخميس ما ذاك عندكم محاضرات أصلا I know you are just from different branches and, and you have different schedules. Tell you what, um, I'm gonna have, uh, I'm gonna have to do. Now uh, I'm gonna have to leave it as as scheduled. Uh, Wednesday. Um, I do apologize for those who cannot attend Wednesday, uh, but it's, the, the lecture will be recorded. Okay. Uh, yeah, it will be recorded. Okay. So. Um, uh, no, you, you go att attend your mass. Attend your mass. M M Mona, where are you from? Mona, where are you from? Where do you have your mass? Briyaz? Record your mass in the Riyaz. Okay, I'm gonna try uh, something. Okay, um, now um, I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. What I'll do. Uh, by the way, um, I, I haven't finished this quite yet. What, what, what I will do. What I will do. Um, I will give you the the, pro the problems that I want you to solve. Okay, and you can try it yourself at home. And I will record. So forget about the CS for now. Let's just concentrate on this. Um, uh, on the IT. What I will do, I have again, I have very important um, um, question for you to solve. Now I, I will give it to you. Uh, try it at home. Try it at home. And um, uh, during the week, I'll, I will record the solution. 
I will record the solution and, and put it on, on the recording session section uh, on Blackboard. Okay, that's for the IT Miwasha. Tafakna? For the IT Miwasha, Tafakna? Okay, Tafakna? Okay, Muntas. Muntas. So I'll take you now the problem. Solve it in the bedroom. And then, or inshallah, بكرة بعد بكرة خلال الفترة هذه راح أسوي recording. هي بس على الدي آخر مسألة بس يعني it has it has many many stages. So بس دقيقة الآن. Okay, it has many stages. So I'll give it to you and try it. And I will record a section for it. Okay? Yeah. Okay, that's that's fine. Munira. Okay, do you have question? Okay, Munira, speak. منيرة؟ السلام عليكم. دكتور بس الله يعافيك، بالنسبة لسؤال الفيتشرز والاكسكيوت، احنا عارفين نستب حقها، بس السؤال كيف راح يجي عليها في الاختبار؟ يعني احنا ما عارفين راح يصير أول شيء في البي سيز والام اي الام اي ار وكذا بس طبيعة السؤال عليها. لكتشر لكتشر 6، لكتشر 6، أي سؤال أجيب لكم اتبعوا الدايجرام. اوكي يعني ولكتشر لكتشر 6 لازم تعرفوا الدايجرام هذا تاع الفيش والاكسكيوت فيري ويل اوكي زائدا ال ال ام جوستاد الفوليوم ان اركتكتشر كيف يشتغل طبعا ممكن ممكن اطلب منكم ترسموا لي الدايجرام هذا ممكن اطلب منكم ترسموا لي الدايجرام اللي هو الطويل هذا الجاي طوليا مش الفوليوم اوكي الدايجرام الجاي طوليا اللي هو فيتش اكسكيوت سايكل اللي البي سي والى اخره ممكن اطلب منكم ترسموا لي اياه وممكن اطلب منكم مثلا رقمين بتسوي انستركشن تاعه بناء على المعطيات يعني بناء على الخطوات ممكن صحيح؟ اوكي لكن شغله شغله اجزاء اجزاء اللي هو الفوليوم يو هاف تو انجستاند اللي هي الديكودر مش المصف الكسر المصف الكسر ما اخذناه الديكودر البصلز ايش هي وايش المدخلات البصلز ومخرجات البصلز واضح يو هاف تو انستاند اوكي اوكي دكتور بس ابغى اقول لك شغله بالنسبه عندنا احنا دكتوراتنا سوى لنا زي اعطتنا في الاكسترا كلاسز زي اسئله قالت حلوها لا سوري اعطتنا اسئله قالت بس عشان اعرف الفيدباك حقي انا كيف اني شرحت المشكله يوم انها جت صلحت لنا تبغى كبي بيست من السلايدات يعني انا مثلا فاهمه الجمله والشيء بس انا لما اجي اعبرها بطريقتي تقولي لا انه مكتوبه في السلايد ابغى نفس اللي في السلايد تكتبي لي اياه هذه نقطه النقطه الثانيه بالنسبه للتحويل من دسمه لباينري احنا الحين لما نجي نحول اول رقم نالي من بحط يطلع لي راح انزله بمحله يصير اخر رقم مثلا زي الاربع تجي مثلا باخر صفة انزلها اربعة نفسها هي تقول لا الطريقة غلط حقتكم يعني تصحيحها على كيف مثلا تصحيحها نص اجوبتنا راح تصير غلط هذا مشكلة احنا معانا في فرع الرياض طبعا دكتوراتنا غير كذا احيانا يعني انت الحين قطعت عنا الاكسترا كلا الفيرتشوال كلاسز هي تشرح شيء نجي معك نفس اللي تقوله نعكس عشان نفهم منك كلامها كله معكوس يعني راح تصير احنا مشاكل في الكلاسز اللي راح ناخذها بعد زيادة في السي اس وال 110 فيعني لازم تشوفون الحل صراحه معها. اوكي طيب اوكي يعني ما هي مشكله بسيطه يعني بسيطه على كل يعني طبعا خذوا يعني خذوا الصافي مني يعني يعني تكست فروم مي اوكي يعني دائما الشغلات اللي احكي لكم اياها تكست فروم مي يعني انا انا اللي اسوي الامتحان معظمه وانا اللي اخلي الاجابات واضح فيعني تكست فروم مي ايش راح اسوي؟ ممكن ان شاء الله بعد ال يعني بعد الميد يعني I might some of you suggested I might I might I might find the time to give you recordings of the lectures okay ممكن ممكن أخليك recordings ممكن إن شاء الله أخليك recordings yeah okay oh yeah okay ممكن أخليك recordings تاع lectures تاعي واضح okay okay تمام خلاص okay رح أخليك recordings تاع المحاضرات تاعي يا اوكي وي هاف باذ سوري وي هاف كويشن فور رشا رشا سبيك رشا رشا ار يو ذير اوكي رشا كان سير يو امين جاد كان سبيك امجد امجد دوسري أمجد 
Okay, you can't hear you, I'm afraid. I can't hear you. Um, do I have speak? Do I have? Okay, can, can I hear you all for some reason, Mona? Mona? Have we uh, lost connection? I can't, I can't hear you. السلام عليكم. وعليكم السلام. أستاذ حبيت أسألك إذا في إذا راح يصير فيه definitions يعني أكتب definitions كاملة في الـ exam. تعرفي I cannot remember بس maybe يعني مثل إيش definition maybe maybe يعني مثلا what is the system هذا الديفينيشن يعني يعني راح يكون ميبي 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 ولا ايباد ولا اي تابلت ولا اي شيء فقط سمبل كالكوليترز يو ار اللاوت اوكي شكرا شكرا يو ريمايند مي فورغوت تو تيل ذس اوكي فاتفقنا يو كان بين كالكوليترز بس يعني اني اني اوضه الكترونيك ديفايس نطلعه شكرا طيب منيرة أيان دكتور في سؤال أنت سألت للطلاب أيام رفتن حقهم أن التقريب بالعدد لما تحاولوا قربوا إلى ثلاث خانات أو أربع خانات يعني حاولنا نفهمه بس أنه مو التقريب العادي وفي نقطة ثانية بالنسبة للكمبس الكمبس من آخر آخر محاضرة اللي هي لكتور سفن قلت بشرحها بعدين وما شرحتها هي داخلة معنا في الاختبار ولا مي بداخلة أيش أيش آخر شيء في لكتشر سامن آخر شيء اللي هي الكومبريشن أو الكومبريس أتوقع كومبريشن 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 إيه صح ما خلاص ما يلا خلاص ما يعمل في عليها الامتحان هذا فامتحان فاينل سوري أف توتالي فورجوت ما شرحت أنا لا ما شرحت قلت إنه يبغى لها وقت وبشرحها بمحاضرة لحالها وما خلاص خلاص حقتنا ما شرحتها وبالنسبة للتقريب إذا تقدر توضح لنا لأنه إذا كان السؤال دقيقة 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 أنا بشرح سوي دقيقة دقيقة. I will write your down بس دقيقة هذا كله راح أخليه الآن في ريكوردد لأن الآن عندي محاضرة الآن عندي محاضرة فيس تو فيس طيب عندنا موضوع التقريب I have to show it أوكي أسوي لكم ريكوردنج الأسبوع هذا راح أحكي فيه التقريب راح أعطيكم الآن مثال يعني أبغى منكم تحلوه وانا راح لكم اياه في في يعني راح اسوي ريكوردنج احل لكم اياه ايضا السؤال هذا تمام الكومباريتن ما يجي معنا هسه يجي معنا في الفاينل بس اولسو ريمايند مي تو اكسبلين ات كومباريتن بس ما هسه ريمايند مي تو اكسبلين ات يلا بعد المد ريمايند مي اوكي الله يعافيك رشا من جديد رشا 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 هذا بقول اوكي رشا ها اسجل لكم محاضرة الاولاد طيب ممكن اسوي هذه اذا هو ممكن نعم صح صح هو ليش فكرت سابقا ما كنت اعرف طريقه لا شوف الطريقه انه هي المحاضره نفسها اقدر اسجلها على الديسك بتاعي واحملها من جديد فا اي مايت دو ذا سيم اي مايت دو ذا سيم يا اوكي ثانك يو ثانك يو جد جواهر Okay, uh, so, okay, sorry, I, I can't hear you to be honest. But okay, now, uh, sorry for the rest of you, I have a lecture now, uh, one minute ago, I started. So, Jamia, of course, if you have a question, send me an email or send me a face-to-face with the lecturer, or send me, I don't have a problem, send me an email, I'll answer you, inshallah. As we agreed, I'll give you now, 
وقد ما في كل المشكله طيب الان مثل ما اتفقنا باقي 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 الاي تي 110 اللي هي الان الريفيجن مثل ما حكيت لكم راح تكون الان مشكله تحلوها وانا راح احل فيها في ريكوردينج تمام بس يعني ارجوكم تحاولوا يعني تراي تو سولف ات فور يور اون بنفيت هذه الشغله الاولى الشغله الثانيه محا... الريفيجن تاع سي اس 140 سي اس 140 سي اس 140 راح اسويه تعرفون متى راح اسويه راح اسوي الاربعاء الاربعاء الساعة تقدر خلال خلال النهار كان يو خلال النهار يعني لو حكيت الثلاثاء الساعة مثلا الثلاثاء الساعة الثلاثاء الساعة الساعة خمس الثلاثاء الساعة أربعة تقدروا الثلاثاء الساعة أربعة تقدروا ايه ايوه عادي خلص اوكي اوكي خلص خلص تمام سي اس اوكي خلص الثلاثاء اوكي عادي الجميع متفق معي الثلاثاء ايه ايه اوكي 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 لا في واحد لا لطيفه لا ايوه بس المعظمية ال 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 ايه قلت تمام جدا رش 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 اكتبي لي سؤالك رش اكتبي لي سؤالك لطيفة خمس ساعات انجليزي ما مشكلة اربعة تكسبي معي ساعة وبعدين يو كان جو فور يور انجلش اقل تكسبي معي ساعة رشا ممكن ارسل لك ستجي على الايميل طبعا ارسل لي ستجي على الايميل ايه طيب ما هي مشكلة لا تفكر خلاص كتبت ان شاء الله ااا آه دكتور استاذتنا تقول انها تاسيسيه لعملات حسابيه ما فهمت ايش يعني قصدك تاسيسيه؟ فورجيت ابوت ذا ذات فورجيت ابوت ذا ذات ايش قصدك بالتاسيسيه؟ المهم لا العمليات راح تجي معنا يعني واعتقد مفهومه لا العمليات على كل يعني لا طبعا كل اللي اعطيتكم اياه هو داخل يعني ال ال شو ما كانت الطريقه المهم تكون صحيحه تكون هم من المدينه آه طيب ما هي مشكله المهم العمليات شرح النظر طيب انا ما مشكله المهم الان فهمتوها من عندي فهمتوها ما فهمتوها اهم شيء انكم فهمتوها فاهمين تمام اوكي هو هذا المهم اوكي المهم افهموا افهموا عني يعني اذا اذا بس ثقوا بكلامي يو يو بي اوكي اوكي يعني ليسن تو مي اوكي آه وطبعا يعني جيت مش بنفيت فروم يور فيس تو فيس الفيس تو فيس يعني يوز ذيم يعني الحقيقه بالعكس اصلا لو طرقت اكثر من طريقه ممكن تكون مفيده يو كان سي بوث بوث ميثود بروفايدنج ذي ار كوركت بروفايدنج ذي ار كوركت اوكي طيب المهم لا ما عندنا مشكله لا دونت تيل مي با يور يور ليكشرز وات دو دو يعني المهم انه تفهموا الماده طيب خلاص اتفقنا او او جيف ذا كويشن ناو And I want you to to have got it, and also I will I will record the the solution. خلاص تفقنا الثلاثة الثلاثة إن شاء الله البدل ستة في إس بدل ستة راح يكون الساعة أربعة تمام. فاللي اللي عنده محاضرة الساعة خمسة أو ستة they can go to it later. تفقنا خلاص أو أو سيل الناسمت. طيب السؤال بس لأنه I have to go to my lecture now. طلاب عيسنوني. طيب السؤال لو حكيت لكم x x تساوي X times X times Y زائد Z X times Y زائد Z طلعوا لي خطوات تاعة طلعوا لي خطوات instruction باستخدام zero zero address machine طلعوا لي خطواتها بالزيرو ادريس ماشين وبال1 ادريس ماشين وبال2 ادريس ماشين وبال3 ادريس ماشين هم ال2 ادريس وال3 ادريس 
طلعوا لي الادريس مشين بالميموري باعتبار الميموري ما بس الميموري ايضا يو هاف تو فايند ذا ريجستري ذا ريجستري اوكي سو عندكم بال بال تو ادريس وثري ادريس طلعوا لي ريجستري ايضا اوكي تمام فسووا لي تيبل سووا لي تيبل مثل ما موجود يعني جدول مثل ما موجود في السلايدات الجدول بالضبط مثل ما موجود في السلايدات وحلوا لي المشكله هذه اكس تساوي لي اكس ضرب واي زائد زد العفو باستخدام ال 1 0 ادريس طبعا ميموري 1 0 ادريس ميموري 2 ادريس و 3 ادريس ميموري وريجستري اوكي دكتور حط لنا بال مو مشكلة ان شاء الله سكشن 6 اوكي لكتشر 6 قصدك لكتشر 6 لكتشر 6 اوكي فاهم فعندنا لكتشر 6 في تقريب وعندنا حلكوا هذا السؤال ثلاث امور لازم نسويها في الريكوردينج تمام ومحاضرة ال سي اس يوم الاربعاء يوم الثلاثاء الساعة 4 بي ام يوم الثلاثاء 4 بي ام اتفقنا خلاص تمام كله تمام اوكي ان شاء الله كومباريسن دون وري باوت ات ويل دو ذا كومباريسن ليتر ما راح تجي معنا في الامتحان الان كومباريسن ما راح يجي معنا في الامتحان الان او ليف ات تو ذا فاينل اوكي واضح اي ان شاء الله اي هوب يو هاف بينفيتد طبعا المحاضره مسجله فيو كان يو كان جو باك تو ات اجين ماي ايميل از اوبن فور يور كويشنز يو كان اسك مي كويشنز اند اي ويل انسر ذيم از سون از بوسيبل بليز 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 ريفايز فيري ويل فور ذا اكزام بليز Okay, uh, I really, I would be, I will be disappointed. Uh, see, look, uh, um, الحقيقة شوفوا, uh, I دائما مع طلابي حتى في الجامعات الماضية درست فيها. I spend all my energy for my students, all my energy. بالمقابل إذا طلابي جاوبوا علامات سيئة, I will be disappointed. إذا طلابي جاوبوا علامات سيئة, I will be disappointed. فلا تجيبوا علامات سيئة أرجوكوا, تجيبوا علامات كويسة, but you have to study the exam. يعني دائما في امتحاناتي طبعا امتحان يعني دائما امتحاناتي شويه تشالنجينج شويه ما هي ما هي سهله ولا هي صعبه. ااا ااا جست سكند ام ام رينج ناو اوكي ام ام رينج ناو اوكي سو يا سو بليز ستدي فيري ويل سو هاف كويشنز بليز اسك مي اوكي ان ذا اكزام دائما بالاسسمنت اي لا اعرفكم ولا تعرفوني بالاسسمنت الاسسمنت عندي مقدسه في الاسسمنت اسئلتي شويه تشالنجينج ولا اعرفكم ولا تعرفوني اتس يو ان يور اون ان ان يور ستدي اوكي سو اني واي لازم اي هاف تو جو ناو سو بالتوفيق اني كويشنز بليز اسك مي ان شاء الله اي ويل سي يو اجين اون تيوزداي فور ذوز هو تيك سي اس ويز مي يلا السلام عليكم تم ايقاف التسجيل